What's up, everyone? This is Mark Sparkling 95 here. We're just gonna close this um, or minimize this. Now, this is one of the mods I created uh, earlier today, or I had an alarm with what she done last night, but there was a few issues in downloading it. Uh, so, this is a, a new updated version. Now, this is more of a rant from some people that were coming on it, all Italian, all under different names. I'm not sure if it's the same cunt. Uh, that's doing it. So it's when this. I'm not even sure if this is a guy or a girl, but Bruno Mod the Revert that like as he's the whatever is fucking Italian. Uh, but this is a translate. Nope, wrong one. That was another one, but we'll just copy it and paste it. Now what this guy is saying uh, is something like it's not. You aren't making farm. It's not making for a Formula One. It's farm simulator. You want better freshness speed. Uh, yeah. So good res reverse mod guys are. I don't. This is Google Translate. So, God forgive me. That uh, this is even the way they spell or pronounce this. But good res reserve mod guys on Farm Simulator Seventeen, not in Formula One. Concentrate to do. Utility work, Lala mod, for example, would have been better at greater freshness speed. Well, I don't like myself. I play Farm Simulator for the mods. Farm Simulator wouldn't be the same without mods. The um, amount of people who play it would be much lower. Um, it's been a great addition to have brought it onto the console and brought mods to it. But, like that, there's like a game by UEG Professional Farmer, which is about £17 in game. Probably inflated by games, right? So probably about a tenner. Uh, and that's what farming simulator would be without mods. Just boring old farming, let's go. Uh, more harvester down here and spend two hours more in one, um, harvesting in one field. So I decided to take one of the, something that would be best for the, one of the biggest fields in Farm Simulator 17 to get it done much quicker. Yes, there is a few side effects that the thing doesn't have much of a stopping distance, but I've actually limited that uh, by adding more brakes. Um, but then the farmers are still, the hired workers are still chaotic with it. But it's to bring more fun into the game. I don't see it as like a serious mod as some of the other modders who like to build everything by the books. Everything has to be realistic, all that. There's no fun if it's realistic, it's just a farm. And as the impression is saying, it sounds boring. Because it is boring. That's why I play the game. That's the why the reason I got the PC version for exploring mods, doing much more things than the standard giants were. They'll give on the consoles. They'll give you five free meter cultivators. There's no need for that. If they're all the same length, you, or width, you just need the one, the one, not five, one. So this is a rant about farming simulator. Yes, it was starting off to, just to with this guy, but it's about farming simulator. People like this, it uh, happened in console as well. Um, when, like, Challenton came out, I think it was Bullet Bill, I'm not sure, but a lot of people were commenting, like, uh, what was the word? <laughs> Complaining about, um, Challenton when it first came out, and then there was Challenton V2, because no one was happy with it on console, and the guy sort of got, apparently got a bit upset about it and that's where I am right now because I I didn't need to release this I didn't have to do this I wanted to but there's people that just insult me like complain about it if you don't want it you don't want this type of fast tractor don't download it as simple as that um I'm not sure if I'm might make another mod. I was thinking of making a Toyota fast mod. Um, 
uh, Toyota Herald Fast Mode and customizing the speed of a fast track to make it the true fast track. So I'm not sure what I'm going to do now. It's just negativity. Um, for I may make one more for this guy over this guy here. So it has one the capa drain capacity of one. Yes, that's one liter. Fuel tank of two liters and top speed of zero. Or forward speed, top speed. Oh, we actually put it one reverse speed, one. Give them, make them fair, and then we'll state it as a hundred and fifty or thirty or something normal corn um, harvester speed. Because that's what he wants. He wants a realistic slow one. Because he wants to spend hours and hours on the one field, boring his fucking eyes out. <sighs> Honestly, the reason I got Farm Simulator 15 or and 11 was well, I got 11 because I seen it for three pounds and Morrison's when I was at college. I thought I may as well spend a couple of month pounds on it, uh, and that was just. I spent like a tenner that day, got a uh, ghost for the PS3 and um, Farm Sim Simulator 2011 for £10. So, £10 together, so yeah. Uh, I didn't spend much on it, and I liked how like, you could get different mods in that. And it's like, I like the game. Not just for the, not just for the, you start already, don't want the music, not just for the farming, but also like the engine of the game. Now, I like a few games, not entirely just because of their that game, but it's more of the engine that surrounds it. Like, Farm Simulator has a good engine, it has a good map size. Like, you can go over fields, all that. It's kind of realistic. Not fully realistic. Um, If we press 9. This is a fairly good map. You've got this big, ma nice main road. You've got these smaller fields. And all that. But I like... The farm simulator 15 because of the ones like Sandy Bay and all these English maps. Because I get, I like big trucks, I like big like convoys, anything like that. Uh, which just didn't think you'd get the same experience in dual, dual truck or something like that because you couldn't exactly drive the things onto the low loader, you couldn't do that. So it felt a bit for what it is, it was lacking what I wanted. And this game has a good mix of it, how you can actually just go and uh, pick a truck. One of these ones, or ones you've downloaded as mods. Um, you've got this big cat one. Uh, which you can change the colour. You don't have enough money. Oh, well it looks like I'll have to go realistic farm and, and hold on for 5 hours, maybe 6 hours or whatever. I'll come back in six months' time with just short of 144,000 just by playing this game legitly. Or I can just do the cheat. Well, first I need to get in a vehicle. Control, Alt, Horn. Simple as that. Well, yes, it's not realistic, but who fucking cares? To earn that money, it's gonna take you about two years. Just sitting driving up and down a field all day. Really? I like mods because, like, I ha in 15, I had like downloaded this big uh, Libya train sort of thing and trying to move it around uh, the Sandy Bay, which was, I think, was sitting Dover. Just moving it around these 
this big long thing that is meant for wider roads, more in like United States and all that. But trying to get around these uh, twisty bends was fun. Not the farming part, the farm bit was just farming. If I wanted to watch, I can set a higher worker to just go and do the work for me. But there's people here that don't like hiring workers because it's unrealistic. Well, I can, if I wanted to um, farming, I could probably just go and apply for a farming job. But I'm not really that into it, I'm more into like the mods, everything about that. If you don't, yes, pe it's a game, but people play different games different ways. I like to play this game trying to entertain myself. And I actually enjoy it. Like, go and making, uh, just, I made some mod, edited some mods in 15 as well. Uh, as I'm getting older, I know, I know how to do a bit more. Uh, like how, all I had to do for, to adjust the speed was look for top speed. Uh, adjust the max torque, or march, max RPM. Because I'm not low down, it was just maxing out at 57. So, I actually had to adjust that. I put all this hard work into it. Going down, sorting all the folders, putting them into the things. Okay, I'm actually going to show you my uh, desktop at the moment. So, these were all in folders. These were all in things, but to upload this mod, these are all the folders I had to pull out. All these ones here. Just to upload the mod, get it all sorted. Uh, well, not the Manta one, that was from a different one. Uh, but I was just trying to center the drive date. And I thought, make something that people want. They're not going to say, oh, we love, we want a um, super fast combine. But there is people, farm, farm simulator fans out there, that do think that sitting down in a harvester for two hours doing field five is not fun. You don't progress much out of it. Uh, you don't really hire workers. And honestly, I don't think I'd actually spend more time, more than probably about 20 minutes, harvesting a field. Uh, and that's why I'm not a little big fan of the missions, especially on the PS4, as it's one of the trophies. Uh, to do every work, a mission for every farmer on whatever map it is because the maps some of the fields are just too big um, and I don't want to spend hours on it just doing everything manually and for being farming simulator it's actually more of farming vehicle simulator because not every farm has big tractors or anything like that Uh, and not every farm is mass over the mass of the field just to my left. The other way I'm thinking it's just or to the back of my house. Ain't that big. Yeah, you can fit a tractor, a cultivator or something in it. But in this game it's like even a small field you can fit the tractor maybe another tractor in it and that's it. Uh, it's just unrealistic. Uh, they've still not don't think they've still not fixed the um, silage bunker where the silage was actually the walls weren't solid, but they were like more of a mesh. What I would say. Uh, so silage was going out the sides. Unrealistic. Then once the bunker was comp looked completely in. Empty those tons that along the walls, unreachable. Yeah, that's really realistic. This has been a mini rant about farm simulator and the people who complain about mods. I do it because I want to. I didn't have to. There was no one that asked me to. Oh, can you make me a? Uh, Super fast combine. I thought it would just be a nice idea. Make the game a bit different for people. 
No. I'm sorry if I've wasted your time, if that's what you want to call it. Uh, but, also, this is just a heads up. To the guy that keeps on commenting on my videos and whatever gibberish language you're speaking in. I'm not being offensive, so I'm just, I can't be arsed. Uh, <laughs> Notice that, just for a comment. I speak English. English is my first language and the only language I know. Are English and Scots. But I'm not very good at Scots. Although I'm in Scotland. Um, so, if you're going to comment on one of my videos, please use Translate. Uh, and if it's a spam comment, I really cannot be interested. Because you've posted, it looks like the same comment in three of my videos. And I don't, that's starting to look like spam. And I've just noticed some of the details in the show. Like the dirt and that. But, yeah. And for those who in about John Deere's never on consoles and that. Uh, like, John Deere, like, I'm in a Facebook group and they, um, and I think, just before we go, I'm in a Facebook group called Farm Simulator 17 PS4 players. Uh, and a lot of them are saying, when will John Deere become their consoles? And a lot of people are saying, Oh, they won't, they won't, or they won't, because John Deere has their own game. Yes, John Deere has their own game. They came out in 2004. 13 years ago. They've not updated it since. They might. But, then they'll deny the fact that giants can easily make a tractor, call it something like Green Deer, or Green John, or whatever. Basically, just upload a big green tractor, land it as lizard because, well, see, lizard. In farming simulator, lizard is basically unbranded products. You can look at them and you can sort of see what they are. Now, this thing would be a Peterbilt. No, that might be actually a Peterbilt. This might actually be a Mac or something. I'm not really good at big uh, American rigs. So don't get me wrong. This is an old Ford pickup truck. This is a newer Ford pickup. Maybe even a Toyota. The more I look at it, it might actually be a Ram or a Chevy. But you can see it's got that sort of shape. And I've not downloaded it. But the Road Rage... Um, is basically the Ford Mustang. So why can't they do the same with John Deere? Why not? There's nothing stopping them. And my honestly opinion of Farm Simulator so far is half arsed. They've had one update which didn't really help much. The only update I've had for the PC was basically to enable mods. Not enable most mods, but that's about it. So thanks for watching everyone, and I'll see you in the next video. I heard it at this. <laughs>